because we're about to have an incredible time now. There's three giraffe staring. There was one young elephant bull that didn't quite like the look of the giraffe, but we're going to have a really great view of these two species of animals together. Look at that, it's so cool. This is amazing. Now, I know it's not a lion or a leopard, but to me, this is so much better because I don't know when I last saw something like this, to be honest, so I find it particularly fantastic. And I hope that you are enjoying it just as much as I am. Because like I said, you don't always get to see this every day. We're lucky, we see lots and lots of cats, but sometimes having an unusual sighting like this, not that it's particularly unusual, it's just we're obviously not at the right places at the right times, and the fact that those giraffe are standing from tall, medium to short, that's even great, greater, better. Lily, who's two years old, you said that there's more elephants. There are, there's so many elephants, Lily, and there's giraffe. How cool are the giraffe? And the elephants are walking right towards us too. This is great. What a fantastic afternoon this is turning out to be. We might just hang around at the dam for the rest of the day. Hello, girl. You're a big girl, aren't you? Can I roll back for you? You're happy. There's one behind the oh. oh, oh, she's okay. She's still quite far back. Hi, guys. Are you going to feed right here now? Now, this is as big as elephant cows get. I'm not going to move around too much. I'm just sussing out the situation. I'm going to shuffle in my seat now. Hi, girl. She's walking straight past. She's just going to cross the road now. Off she goes. They're going back down to the dam. No, I think the giraffe are waiting for their gap. They're obviously being courteous as well and saying, right, elephants, you go first. We'll come in next. Don't worry. This is so nice. Now the, elephant, now the giraffe are coming too. Come on, giraffe. Don't be afraid. Hi, big girl. Now, I always talk to the elephants. I talk to all the animals, but elephants in particular, because I'm 100% sure that you can calm an elephant down just by the tone of your voice. And most guides will agree with me because every single one of them would have done so. It's very difficult to be quiet in a sighting like this. They really do respond to the tone of your voice. So it's not that they can understand me again. It's just feeding off, I think, vibes. Look at that. Now, Lorena, I have to agree with you 150%. You've said that it's so nice to see elephants after not seeing them for so long. Yep, I agree. And it's so nice to see elephants and giraffe interacting, feeding together, and hopefully even drinking together at some point. But I just wanted to see this little one's not having any of us going, nah. <laughs> it's a little bit nervous. Are you scared? Don't be scared. It's okay. So it just shows you not all the big males are big and brave, hey? Well, he's not particularly big. He's quite young. He's one, he's at that age that he would be the one giving us lots of trouble. Not worried at all. But the giraffe are making a run for it now. They're going right. Seeing as though those, those giants have moved, we're going to tower over them too. Although they're just feeding. You're just standing, staring at us. You're not quite sure as to what's going on just yet. What I do want to do though, is I want to try and get in front of these giraffe because I want to wait for them, but I don't want to disturb them. So let's do that while we haven't got any more roadblock. We're going to just go past these giraffe. We're going to go down to the dam. It's looking good, Sebastian. I agree with you. Hello, giraffes. It's quite nice. But they'll come down. They'll be here shortly. Very pretty. Okay, let's go. We'll see you now, giraffe. Five minutes. Down at the dam. Let's see if they're on time. I don't think giraffe are particularly good at um, being punctual. They need to work on that. So, yes, we're totally going to go down here. We're going to go whoop. Now, the reason why I'm not worried about going off-road over here is because we've got the water in front of us. So we've got a natural 